Oh, okay. Live, live here happening. It's the L. Bean Custom Tote Competition, and you enter a contest to potentially win your customized L. L. Bean Tote, which is you really cool. You eventually get to do more things nice. than just. And uh, then we have our beauty spa area where people love coming here for that. So we have Ginger and Liz doing manicures. Um, and they're these two oh, chicks who used to dance on poles, and they were video vixens, and now they're entrepreneurs, and I love them. And we have Fido, the hair care company, launching their styling products, which is really exciting that we're helping them lift that off. Jouet Cosmetics, which means to play in French. And Jouet has all of these, these um, little clickable components that you can put together your own beauty kit, so it clicks all together, and you can customize your own little beauty palette. Um, what else do we have here? Smart Water launching right. their Vitamin Water Zero. So that's really cool. The label's completely changed. It's metallic. It's very futuristic. And nobody wants an extra calorie that they don't need, particularly during Fashion Week, when you tend to not be able to eat properly, and which is why we have the Blueprint Cleanse. Blueprint Cleanse is here. And their Rock and Republic yeah, jeans are here, one of my favorites. We have um, Shitobu, Shaping, Toning, and Building. So it, it's actually shapewear that has resistance bands <laughs> built in, burns 12% more calories in normal day-to-day -day activities. So you don't wear it to the gym, you just wear it to work, and you're burning a few more calories. Made in form, fixing boobs from the tents. Two boobs at a time, I was going to say one at a time, but it's usually two at a time coming through. Right. And uh, they're lifting, and I don't think they're separating anymore, but they're lifting and enhancing. And yeah. what else do we have in Carrera. here? The what Carrera, is it? Carrera sunglasses. Oh my God, my right? favorite! How would I forget? How would I forget them? Carrera sunglasses, my favorite. You yeah, are so never without sunglasses. I'm never without sunglasses, and actually, most photographs of me, I'm wearing Carrera sunglasses. But I've been wearing them a long time, long before they became incredibly popular, because I love them because they are a little edgy. There's something a little street about them, and at the same time, they seem really sophisticated and classic. And I like that in anything I own, for those two qualities to be there, where it feels a little. Little, little sort of edgy mm -hmm. and really classic. It's perfect for me then. Ooh, that's kind of cute. That's it. I feel like. Oh, an absolute. I've been drinking it for breakfast. Not straight up. Oh, and you can't forget the popcorn. You can't. Oh my God, Indiana popcorn. So yeah, my for breakfast I basically have an absolute berry acai cocktail and a bag of Indiana popcorn, the cheddar cheese flavor, because I think it's like an omelet. I don't know, but I love it. Okay, and tell me quickly about your show. My show, the Robert Verdi show starring Robert Verdi. Yeah. It just launched, it just premiered on February 13th on the Logo channel, 10 p.m. every Wednesday night on Logo. And it's a reality show, reality show, that follows me in my real life while I try to do really outrageous things. And there's a huge component of it that's improv comedy. And we set up outrageous situations where I go in and pitch kooky ideas and see how people respond to my desire to become an internationally... Um, an internationally beloved cartoon character or to open my own mall or even have my own award ceremony and I pitch it to people and see if I can get them on board and work with me okay. and it never works <laughs> great and um, so tell me do you have any styling tips for people with a petite frame like I love that me? question um, <laughs> if you if you have a petite frame it's it's all about volume and fit so a lot of times girls who are tiny don't know that they, I, I think the skirt should never go below the knee. I think it's always good to wear things with a heel. I mean, it's hard to wear it all day, but it's good to wear it with the heel because it gives you a more statuesque feeling. You feel more confident. Um, and I think also making sure things are tailored, sleeves are not long. I think that's also one of the, the biggest problems with petite women is that it's hard to find clothes that are proportioned for their bodies. It's good to shop in a petite's department um, so that you know things are proportioned for your body. And definitely make their things, sure things are shaped to your waistline. You know, things that are really loose and like A-line or tunic shape. You kind of get lost. You get lost in yeah. the fabric. Yeah. It's interesting how a little fabric can really lose, can really overwhelm a small girl. So it's mm -hmm. all about a real Gina, good look, fit. Skimming the body is important. Yeah. You basically okay. just... Okay. Oh, and monochromatic is great for a small girl too because if you wear one color from top to bottom, from shoulder to toe, you're going to look taller. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, and last question. What is your biggest fashion pet peeve? My biggest fashion pet peeve. Do I even have one? I kind of like so many things about fashion. I like all the expression that people can have in the world of fashion and so I 
don't know that there's anything that I don't like. Stop. Maybe I can't I get into like acid wash denim ever again. Mm-hmm. Even though it's kind of popular again to another generation, I just don't see it as something that we've lived through exciting. it already yeah. we don't want to live through it been again. there done that there's a lot of things that have been there done that and will do again um but acid wash denim is not one of them i got rid of all my acid wash denim that's too neutral no. <laughs> oh my gosh she has gone all over the map here it is really this is the best reality no, tv all right, well, thank that you. I like that one better. I know, I That's did. fun. I what I say, but I was just playing more because it's fun to play. No, it's good because then I can um, get Well, thanks, Robert. Oh, thank you. Thank you.